Hello and welcome to the Bedtime Buddy with William Lau Bedtime Stories podcast. And we're so excited to take you on this journey to the land of dreams. Bedtime stories are a special time where we get to let our imaginations run wild and explore new worlds. We have a whole treasure trove of stories for you to enjoy, ranging from fairy tales to adventures and everything in between. Each week, we'll share a brand new story that will take you on an incredible journey. So snuggle up in your bed, close your eyes, and let your imagination take you away to the magical world of dreams. Sweet dreams, little ones. The Adventures of Leo and Zorg Once upon a time, in a small house nestled on the outskirts of a peaceful town, lived a young boy named Leo. Leo had always been fascinated by the mysteries of the universe. Every night, he would lie in bed and gaze at the stars, wondering what secrets they held. Little did he know that his life was about to change forever. One clear and starry night, as Leo lay in bed, he heard a loud crash coming from his backyard. Curiosity sparked within him, and he couldn't resist investigating the source of the commotion. Carefully, he crept downstairs, tiptoed past his parents' room, and headed towards the back door. Stepping into the moonlit night, Leo's eyes widened in amazement. Right there, amidst the flowers and grass, was a strange silver spacecraft. Its metal glistened under the moon and steam hissed from its damaged engines. Leo's heart raced with excitement and wonder as he approached the ship. Hesitantly, he opened the hatch and peered inside. To his surprise, he discovered a small, friendly alien named Zorg. Zorg had turquoise skin, big round eyes, and long tentacle-like arms. Despite the initial shock, Leo and Zorg quickly became friends, bound by an unspoken understanding. Realizing that Zorg needed help, Leo decided to keep him hidden in his treehouse, ensuring his safety while trying to repair the damaged spacecraft. Every night, under the shimmering moonlight, the two companions worked tirelessly to fix the spaceship using Leo's vast collection of tools and his boundless determination. As weeks turned into months, Leo and Zorg fought an unbreakable bond. They shared stories, laughter, and dreams of the vast galaxies beyond Earth. Leo's parents began to notice his newfound happiness and enthusiasm, but they remained unaware of his extraordinary secret. However, the day finally arrived when Leo and Zorg completed the repairs on the spacecraft. The time had come for Zorg to return to his own kind, who awaited him in the far reaches of the universe. Deep inside, Leo understood that their time together was limited, but his heart couldn't help but ache at the thought of saying goodbye to his alien friend. With heavy hearts, Leo and Zorg stood beside a spaceship, ready for departure, Tears welled up in Leo's eyes as he hugged Zorg tightly. I'll miss you, my friend, Leo whispered, his voice filled with a mix of joy and sorrow. Zorg's eyes shimmered with gratitude and affection. Thank you, Leo, Zorg replied, his voice filled with warmth. You have given me the gift of friendship and restored my hope. I will never forget you. As the spaceship engines roared to life, Leo stepped back, watching his friend ascend into the night sky. Zord waved goodbye, his tentacle-like arms reaching out a final farewell. The spaceship soared higher and higher until it disappeared, leaving only the echoes of Leo's memories. In the days that followed, Leo couldn't help but feel a sense of emptiness without Zorg by his side. He missed the adventures 
and their shared dreams. However, he took solace in knowing that his friendship had made a profound impact on Zorg's life. Months turned into years and Leo grew older, but he never forgot the lessons he learned from his extraterrestrial companion. He carried the memories in his heart, cherishing them as a precious treasure. Leo continued to gaze at the stars, knowing that somewhere out there, Zorg was exploring the wonders of the universe, surrounded by his own kind. And so, dear children, as you lay in bed and look up at the night sky, remember the story of Leo and Zorg. It is a tale of friendship, resilience, and the bittersweet nature of parting ways. Just like Leo, you too may have to say goodbye to a cherished friend someday. But always remember, the memories you create together will forever be etched in your hearts, guiding you on your own extraordinary journeys. Good night, little dreamers, and may your dreams take you on adventures beyond the stars. V. End. This original story was read by William Lau. Be sure to subscribe to CCB TV YouTube channel for more stories from Bedtime Buddy with William Lau. Do also like and follow on CCB TV Facebook and Instagram. You can also listen to us on Spotify, iTunes, and Google Podcast. Good night. Thank you.